My name is Norman Chan. I'm the co-founder and also the head of engineering of Aqua Corporation Limited. Our company aims to be the uh, world's first sauna-based drowning prevention and swimmer safety solution. As you can see, this is our sauna and this is our real one. And in the middle part, there is a sauna itself with our tailor-made mounting kit. And this mounting kit will be mounted in the swimming pool side and then the sauna will keep elab, uh, emit the ultrasonic wave and then when it hits a swimmer, and we, it will bounce back and then so that we can extract some sauna images. And let me show you. As you can see, there's a swimmer here and uh, you can see that the sauna keeps scanning and you can see this little dot, which is the sauna image collected by the sauna. And we are going to use the positioning information as well as the gesture to determine the drowning risk of the swimmer. And after we collect such information, we do have a waterproof tablet. This waterproof tablet provides the information for the lifeguard and also the user, or maybe the parents, to know about their kids, to know about the user, whether they do have any safety issue. And as you can see this dot, this dot is represent one swimmer. And later on, later on, Assuming that this uh, incident, it will be turned into yellow and then orange and then red color. Each color represents different level of the risk. And this is our solution overall architecture. As you can see, we do have some sauna installed into each swimming pool. The number of sauna will be varies for different swimming pool size and the requirement of the users. And all the sauna data together with some water quality data can be collected into our aquas uh, bring edge computer and in this edge computer we will do the edge processing to determine the drowning risk and after this drowning risk all the processed data will be sent to the user as well as back up to the cloud and with our uh, proprietary uh, routing network I, we are E6, uh, the company for doing the 5G network and technology. You can see there, there's some box here. It's called the ocean nodes. Uh, it means something uh, from the ocean. We have a 50 kilometer of the network for 5G connect back to the ocean for the marine time business. So you largely reduce uh, the cost of the, the, the marine time, uh, also increase the speed. Uh, but at the same time, actually, uh, for this one, uh, apart from the marine time or the boats or, or sailing or something, it can be working on like offshore uh, wind farm, oil farm, etc. Anything on the marine, you can use 5G to connect. So it changed the world, changed the whole business of the communication of the, of the marine time. Okay. And E6 actually, foundation of E6 is doing some kind of industrial uh, 5G network solution, like this uh, we call the router. This called router is uh, called high speed router with a vegetized design. Uh, you can under maybe almost 80 degrees in the summer and minus 30 degrees in the winter. It can still work fine. And also maybe inside the factory for smart city like lampposts, okay, factory control, AGV ports, etc. Uh, for example, the truck control, uh, managing the, all the AGV together through 5G rather than the, just a landline. Yeah. And to prove the vegetized design, you can take a look here. Yeah, you see, it's working inside the water. Correct, it's right, yeah. Actually, we are not inside the water, inside the water, but it's waterproof. So whenever there's a flooding, when you're doing the business, running the network, it's still very smooth. We can combine all the 5G network, 4G network, Wi-Fi, IAPRS, or broadband, etc. every network together. Make sure there's a reliable network under any environment and in anywhere in the world. Hi everyone, my name is Daniel. It is an absolute honor to be attending and participating in this year's MWC 2025 in Barcelona. The name of my startup is called Google Charts and the platform that we brought here today for MWC is Appora.io. And what I would like to show you is an actual demo uh, in the screen here. With the platform, it is designed to seamlessly help anybody anywhere in the world to be able to place and create an ad um, in all under three minutes uh, across 60 countries globally. So here's a, a, a real life demo. So we click on the creation of the campaign and you select and search uh, any app that um, your, maybe your app or your customer's app. So for example, we'll go for Uber. 
And this is a live um, feed API connecting with this particular platform, which is Apple right now, uh, for uh, United States of America as the target country. So these are live uh, feeds. You click onto it, you click next, and uh, on any one of these platforms. Right now, uh, to the public, in this trade show, we're offering Apple Search Ads, but we are connected with Google, Facebook, Meta, and Twitter, which is X. So we go on next, and this is another live feed pulling from the App Store. Um, this is what the app looks like right now. So uh, you would normally type in the keywords, for example, Uber, if you want your users to find with the related uh, uh, app, which is using Uber, or uh, taxi, or, or riding app, for example. But this is, this is the key part. The beauty of this app is that it's got an AI feature here, so we click on this, and it will automatically generate the rest of the keywords for you, so you don't have to spend time to go on Google and do the research for you. This will create all the keywords that are relevant for you, as it displays here, all under 10 seconds. So we focus on providing uh, visual spatial uh, navigation for the surgeons. So what we are doing is we're trying to use uh, some sort of uh, AR glasses and then we produce the software solutions to provide the patient medical image uh, for, for the doctor to use it inside the operating room. For example, if you look at the video here, uh, we are able to use uh, the medical scans such as CT, MRI and then we have our own AI automation to convert those uh, medical scan into hologram and then the doctor can see it in the glasses and also overlay accurately on top of the actual patient. So in a sense it becomes a map uh, to guide uh, or to locate uh, the pathology. So uh, we get rid of a lot of pauses inside the operation so the doctor knows uh, exactly what to do for each uh, step. So we ex essentially we make the surgery uh, faster, safer and more accurate. So, um, and also the doctor can share his uh, first person view and stream out. So this also helps, uh, you know, people outside of the operation room and see what he's doing. And we can also connect experts from different parts of the world to, you know, uh, collaborate on to work on the same surgery. So in a sense, uh, this technology can uh, facilitate and also improve the productivity of uh, uh, medical doctors. So this one is with our MGS Micro Gimbal Stabilizer camera and this is a uh, smartphone OIS. As you can see, uh, for the smartphone OIS, it is very shaky, uh, but for our MGS, we can make it very stable under the same uh, condition because we tilt our lens and sensor together like gimbal. So I will show you. So here, so when I move this uh, Spot TV with our solution, so the camera move in the opposite direction, very obviously, because this one can do up to five degree compensation. And for the traditional smartphone OIS optical image stabilizer, they can only do one degree, okay? Besides the very good uh, performance, we make it very small small enough to be embed even in your smartphones okay so this is very small one so uh, this is tailor made for one of the smartphone companies and uh, this is very small and besides uh, this year we have the new technology uh, this the previous one is can only do two access gimbal stabilizer this one can do uh, three access okay this one can additionally do the roll compensation so this one can uh, it's very suitable for drones so that's why this year we get the Innovation Award okay, for the, this free access gimbal stabilizer. This is only a size of sugar cube, very small. And compared with the traditional uh, free access gimbal, the smallest one, uh, this one, our MGS, is only one tenth of the size and one third of the weight. Okay? So that's why this is very suitable for uh, small drones. Besides our Micro Gimbal Stabilizer technology, we have other OI solutions like this one. Okay, so this one with a very small, very tiny OIS uh, camera modules. Okay, so some of uh, our customer end product already using this technology for their small device. Okay.